All right. So, go to the bazaar in Japantown is one of the many, many quests that are currently available to us. I know Pan Am wanted us to go do something. What was that? Sit and wait for Bill. Go to the chapel. Get back close to the Delamain cab. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Alright, Daka, you have yourself a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Um... Let's go ahead and see what Pan Am's wanting, because it seemed quite serious when she called us. So that's going to take us all the way ba back out here. So do we have a fast travel point? Yes, we do. At least take us part of the way. Oh wait, we do have a fast travel here. Oh, this is the mobile camp. Ah, yes. I do like these missions with Pan Am, so. And this also gives us an opportunity to look at some of the weapons here. Doesn't seem like you get a lot of customers, huh? True, but I get by for my regulars. Well, how's that? They buy a new iron every week? They bring them in for repair. The sand, it gets into every opening, every little crack. You gotta take them apart, air blast them every once in a while. If you don't, well, might eventually find yourself wishing you did. Hmm. Want to see what you got in stock. Browse to your heart's content. Ooh, sniper rifle. Pistol, pistol, pistol. Man. Nothing that we really need. We'll break that down for parts. Blooming amber bandana. I don't remember when we got that. Still have our tequila. Let's go ahead and sell all of these health boosters. Because I don't think we need them. I thought that was our our um, our heal. But that was not the case. Okay. Where is Pan Am at? V, it's good you're here. I had no idea you and the Aldecaldos had made up. They continue to grind my gears something terrible. But, you know... They're family. Exactly. What happened? Spit it out. The Wraiths took Sol. The Brick Brain ventured out with a small patrol and never came back. Sure it was Wraiths? We've been observing their camp. We know they're holding prisoners, including someone important. We need to free Saul. I don't know why, but I felt I could count on you. Always Pan Am. You and me are chooms. Thought that was clear. Careful, or I'll start believing that. You won't be able to get rid of me. I'll survive, I'm sure. Whatever goodwill you might feel, I'm sure you won't turn down one of the best sniper rifles on the West Coast. A Tektronica Grodd. You saw it in action already. That and the gratitude of the Caldos. Sounds fancy. Once you have it in hand, fancy all of a sudden becomes kick-ass. Let's go. Mitch will walk you through the details. At least Mitch is still around doing stuff. Man, the lighting in this game, oh, I was kind of... Pan Am and V, what's going on there? Nothing. After what happened to Scorpion, he shows up here? Guess probably for Saul. Ignore that. Hey, Panna. Seriously? You really aim to do this? Someone has to. You know you have a piston missing, right? Someone has to. 
he's not he's not wrong. It's alright though. We'll make it work. Where's Mitch? He was supposed to meet me here. He'll be here any minute. Huh. You never mentioned seeking outside help. We can use all the help we can get. Hi. Ooh. Okay, how you want to do this? Quietly. An open assault would be suicide. Mitch is already setting up the recon. You'll sneak into the Wraith's camp while I cover you. Going in quiet. Two's all you need. It's not that I don't want to go to serve some raffins up some justice. It's just... Look around! The last attacks left barely half of us standing. Our supplies are stuck outside goddamn Reno, and our gear... Don't get me started. We're up shit creek, static. And I don't know if we're ever gonna find or fashion a paddle. Try as we might. Your leader gets nabbed and you, what, hope for the best? Rather than I think about what you do for the ones at the bottom of your food chain. You're asking for trouble. Leave it. He has a right not to understand. Oh, there's Mitch. Howdy, Mitch. I floated a drone over the Wraith's camp. Will you take a look, or would you rather keep mouthing off? Mitch, how you been? Wishing duct tape could right all the world's wrongs. And hey, it shouldn't be me occupying your thoughts, but Saul. Hey, Raven. You taking a look or not? Let's see what we got here. The Raffins can't see it. Active camo, but that practically inhales battery juice, so make it quick. They found an abandoned cement plant to squat in, with a mass of heavy gear. Locusts would be a better name for them. They fly into a place, strip it of all it's got, then move on. But this time... Do you see the wall? They've added some primitive security measures. Hmm... It points to them aiming to stay longer. The question is why. Who knows for sure, but I would guess that Saul is part of the reason. If he's still there, we have to find a way inside. Breathe, sniper. I mean, we can certainly do this. That guard post is probably connected to the rest of the camp. way in. Maybe, but there are also breaches in the wall. Lightly guarded sections. Not too bad. How about yourself? How's your Saturday treating you? Do you see the tracks? Tire tracks. Their vehicles were moving heavy freight. It could have been equipment. Either that or Saul's not their only prisoner. The tracks lead to the truck. Can you scan it? That's probably the one they kept Saul in. The main building. There. Saul must be inside. Quite a spread. I feel like looking for a diamond in a hailstorm. They haven't scrapped and gutted the place for parts. You could access the local camnet. You would just need to find the control room. It's fair. Okay. There's plenty of ways we can get in.
The Skywalk. It connects the garage to the main structure. Okay, got some stuff to work with now. Is everything clear? Yep. Let's go get Saul. Perfect. Mitch, is the van primed? I did what I could. Take a tour. I'm doing all right, Raven. Just relaxing. Enjoying the weekend. Glad you're inside out of that wind. Solid job. I mostly improvised, actually. Either way, it'll have to do. Hold on a minute, I got one more thing. If you find Saul hasn't flatlined, you'll probably need this. Spike Superjet. A rhino dose. It should speed up Saul's central pump. <laughs> Neat. Hope so. Doubt I could carry him out of my bag. So that should be everything. V, will you ride with me? Yeah, of course I'm going with you. Okay, you take the wheel. One me driving. Yep, I need to fiddle with my scope a bit. No, you get to fiddling. I'll try not to kill us all. Oh, yeah. We even have a radio in here. Take it for a spin if you like. Okay. Well, I can't do that right now. Hey, Beskar, what's going on, buddy? Welcome. Caught us on the way to a rescue operation. I still can't believe he let himself get captured. Anyone else? But Saul? You said yourself he's not at the top of his form. Yes, but moving civilians across the border during a bombardment? Hijacking a petrochem tanker? Opening the valves, cranking a few figure eights to set the desert ablaze and give the kids a fun show. That's the salt I remember. All that are idols. I know. It's just. Yeah, those are pretty cool. Holy. Do you see Ooh. that? It's bad and more than its look. We have to move quickly. Okay, now we're in freaking Dune. We need to hide the car. Park beside that outcrop. Okay, out. I'll find a place to roost and keep you in sight. You just watch yourself down there. Seems like a good place to infiltrate. Just cool, calm, and collected. Ooh. And silent headshots for days. Thank you. Ah. 
I went full pistola. Damn it, stay out of sight. No. You don't need to worry about me. See? Okay. Enemies have been alerted. That's not a big deal. Come on. I just want to talk. Mhm. Mm You're weird. Listen, okay, main building. Watch for vermin. Saul is somewhere inside. I feel it in my bones. Remember what I told you. Find the control room and you'll gain access to the security camps. God, these guys have two life bars and I'm just... Take them out in one shot. I love it. Uh huh. What the hell? Stealth is okay once you kill everyone in stealth. Yeah. If you all are just going to come out and check on the bodies, we can just make a day of this. I'm completely okay. Scouting reports regarding the breakers, inheritance. I'm gonna find you sooner or later. Let's turn off the surveillance system. Okay. People are dead now. Keep your head down and plow straight ahead. That should be their garage. It's heavily guarded. Mm -hmm. Knowing them, they have something important in there. You might even gain access to the security system. It's okay. They're all dead already. Mutant by Moonlight. What are you fine? Get out here. Get Okay, I think there's like still one more person I haven't killed on the grounds yet. Nothing to be shy about. Keep 
Keep your eyes peeled. I see several heavy hitters. What are you, five? Get out here! Problem solver. Woo! This iconic uh, submachine gun. Writing, I gotta deal with this shit. Well, I'm kind of glad we went ahead and did, the, did it this way. Not that I'm ever going to use the thing, but it's nice to have the iconic weapons. Oh, someone's in there talking trash. I think we can go inside now. Plus we can sell, we can sell a lot of this stuff. And I spent a lot of money in the last stream on um, like grenade upgrades, which I also never use, but it was just nice to have them. So need to get our capital back to where we were. That's some L.A. Noir mu music. All right. Saul, Saul, Saul. That, that boondock saints energy. <laughs> oh. oh, Pan Am. Got a girl here. Dead. Disemboweled. And not just for her chrome, I don't think. Fucking Raffins. Solus built. There's no line they won't cross. None. Well, if it helps, I've killed most of them. Red. Ah. What was that about fun, ma'am? Hmm? Militech. Apogee. Oh, that's what we need. Is that right there? Ooh, we got some good stuff right there. Holy crap. Scouting report. All right. Right. I think I got eyes on him. Is he breathing? I think so. Good. Grab him and get out of there. Saul. Do, do, do you have my goddamn cigar? Your cigar? I told you, sons of bitches. A cigar, some ice cold hooch, and a couple of ladies to keep me company. Either that, or you can kiss my keister. 
Easy, Saul. I'm here with Pan Am. Pan Am? But... she left. Not forever. Gonna get you out. You... I remember. You're that merc. Can you walk? Fuck! I'll take that as a no. Something is out of whack. Pretty badly beat. Probably could use this. Wake you up in the morning, boy. Oh, yeah. So, how is he? Time to don my dancing shoes. Seems not bad at all. Demanded a cigar and some companions. That does sound like Saul. Now get yourselves out of there. On our way out now. I'm firing up the engine. I'll be right there. Got by the post and guards. Mm -hmm. And if we can be just as sly together, I might get out without firing a shot. Exactly. There should be a quick exit out of the cellar. But they're all dead, guys. It's okay. The garbage chute. What a wonderful idea. What an incredible smell you've discovered. Oof. Go, go, go. Come on, Saul. Thank you. That storm is picking up steam. Good. It'll cover our tracks. So? Anyway, we have good reason not to head straight back to camp. There's no need to play it safe. We'll just burn time. Better late and safe than dead. Probably owe Pan Am an apology there, sir. Yep, this isn't awkward. <laughs> She's trying to... I need some music. I need some good music. I have no idea where we're going. I guess we're going back to camp. <clears throat> or at least to like a safe house or something. Said, uh, they, they seem to have an argument about that. Ooh. It'll just whip us off this road. We need to find shelter. The Ingalls farm? Good idea. Okay, safe house. You two know? No one's lived there a while. Biotechnica saw to that. Did they say the Ingalls farm? Little house on the prairie. Bum bum ba dum. Do you see those buildings? We'll wait it out there. I remember this place. It should be safe, at least for now. God, it looks like hell is right behind us. Oh, we're here. Inside, quick! Oh, that's just the brake lights glowing. Uh, I need to catch my breath. He's dark in here. Uh, uh, just in time for dinner. I'm not hungry. I just swallowed a pound of sand. Looks like we're in for the night. A little power might be useful. 
Right. Could you help me look, V? I'll search in here. Okay. Ooh. A lot of useful. Smuggling. Thanks. The angles left in a hurry. It is the angles. That's awesome. Them a good offer. Yeah. Prime. Sell us your land. You don't know that. No bulldozers, no backhoe loaders ever showed up. Lousy rotten way to get them out. Deal with the corp, you end with nothing, Saul. Don't go there. Not now. Much better. And no corpses or anything? That's pleasant. Damn, it's getting cold. I tried to get us some heat in here, but no luck. Can you check it? Might have the magic touch. Actually, you know what? Check the fuse outside. It might have come loose. If so, just whack it back in place and I'll get this junk burning. Right. Give me a sec. Thank you. If Saul freezes to death, it will have been a waste of day. Fun. I was hoping that was going to open the garage. Whew. See what I see? Ooh. Expiration dates from before the last war, so hopefully it hasn't turned to poison. Today's our lucky day. Lucky. Interesting choice of words. Do I hear a lecture coming on? No. No lecture. But we do need to talk. That Wraith's crap. It shouldn't have happened. They wanted everything. Our camp locations, routes, offloading points. If they knew what state we're in, one or two more raids and that'd be the end of us. And if you hadn't mounted a raid of your own, well, that would have been the end of me. Oh, it's not the time for this. You're both exhausted. Maybe you're right. We can't hope to handle the Raffins alone. So you would sell us out to Biotechnica? Vade, tell him it's a damn rotten idea. Eh. I gotta agree with Pan Am. Sounds like a truly shitty idea. Thanks. What could you possibly know about it? More than you think, Saul. Used to work for Arasaka, so seen plenty. Arasaka's not Biotechnica. The difference is not in the ammo. That's always the same. You know what you are to them? Welcome back. Labor. To be exploited and ultimately consumed. Best case scenario. Thank you, V. I could not have said it better. We've had our spats. A few. Like any family. They're not worth digging up. I think so, too. If you'd like to come back... Everyone will be waiting. Arms open wide. With arms wide open. No more jumping to the front of the line. And so it begins. You know what, sweetheart? We'll have plenty of time to tear at each other's throats later. That is my hope. But right now, I wouldn't mind catching a few winks. Need help? Fuck off. Huh. Do you know what they call these storms in North Africa? Haboobs. Damn, I love that word. <laughs> Whoa. 
Wow, what was that about? Hmm. To her boobs. Yeah. To her boobs. Lord. <laughs> Is any better? No, just different. Yeah, this would make for a decent little motel, wouldn't it? Little fireplace, booze. Grumpy guy at reception is the one thing missing. Have everything you need, ma'am. Mm hmm. I couldn't ask for more. Ooh. How's your whiskey, ma'am? Metallic aftertaste. Bold, yet smooth. Four out of five stars. Ma'am, I'm sure you'd be cozier with your shoes off. <laughs> After a full day in them, I'd fear a health code violation. Nonsense. After a day as full as today, you deserve to kick back. Oh? And what did you have in mind? Have you ever given a woman, a lady, a foot massage? <laughs> Flirt. Got a few ideas. Think you know what kind? Uh, the. Don't hit me. No. Ah. It's really nice as is. Let's not spoil it, okay? I, I'm, I'm sorry. Didn't know what I was thinking. No, it's fine. Truly, don't let it worry you. Boo. All right. Right. So, friends, then. B, I'm glad you came. Really. Thanks. It meant a lot to me. Ooh, do you hear that? Nope. Hmm. Mm-hmm. The wind has waned. I can't speak for her boobs, but when a Chinook rolls rough and rowdy across the plain, I sure can't get any, should I? Not a wink. Well, that was quick. Hey, Johnny. On behalf of the staff of the Independent California Motel, I wish you all sweet dreams. We up and about, and everyone left. Imagine that. Oh, is she outside? Look who's alive. Hey, did you sleep all right? Good work, V. Old style raid. It's all doing all right? Cracked skull, six busted ribs, bruised kidneys, but he's back at it. Bossing folk every which way. You? Hey, you gotta agree now. Next time, I choose the motel. <laughs> if there is such a time. Well, I slept like a puppy. That's a cozy shoulder you have there. <sighs> it's too bad I better get rolling in a minute. Oh, wait, hang on. I thought you were headed back to the Alicaldos. Staying with the clan. That remains so. Come on. Last night, when we were talking to Saul... Oh. Thanks for standing up for me. Though, one thing... The Wraiths, the Raid... It's the start of something we need to prepare for. Saul will get everything set up in camp. Whereas I... Whereas you... The Raffins wanted to know our roots, right? Well, it's the Aldecaldo's turn. Some recon is in order. One more thing. Your compensation. Please take care of her. She served me well.
Overwatch. Putting her in good hands, Pan Am. I know. So, uh, thank you. Once again. Oh. Uh, hold up. About last night. We don't need to talk about that. I'm just not like that. So what are you like? More like this. Oh, all right. <laughs> Take care of yourself. You too, Pan Am. And remember, I'm indebted. Circumstances were different. I'd say saddle up and ride after her. But here and now, just look. Damn hard to catch a girl like that. Only hope you've got is they feel a pang and stop to wait. What's with you? Dunno, a memory, maybe. Don't matter. Okay, back to town, V. Headed up to here with this gusty outback. Riders on the storm. Alright. Um, let me go ahead and fire up my little guide here. Oops. It's like we're getting pretty close to what we're wanting in terms of our stats. But I know that we definitely did get a piece of cyberware that we need to install. Alright. So, let's see. At level... 50... That's a difference of 3 and then a difference of 2. Right? Yeah, tech. And then, so tech cool can go up to 15 by 50. That works for me. Um. Now what? We got quite a bit. Well, we need to go to a ripper dock, um, for sure. I guess now would be time to go ahead and uh, go to the bazaar in Japantown. We were gonna, we were planning on doing that, but things got in the way. Oh, we got the. The, the Harley fat boy here. And we will just motor back to town. Where's the Pacific Dreams? There we go. Well, this is some jazz. check to make sure what we're doing journal detective ward bill sandra claire yeah oh god yeah just That was close. We got it, though.
Got to see what our boy Takamura is up to. Also wondering if we're going to get attacked randomly again like we did before. This motorcycle's not bad. I think everything's good, all things considered. Oh. Hey, Judy, what's up? Something happened? Yeah. Just come. Oh, God. Okay. I have a feeling something horrible happened to Evelyn. Judging by her tone. She was not in good shape when we left. So we'll have to wait for a little bit. Takamura has been very patient, as we've seen. This kind of takes priority over anything else. Because when I hear them say, come quick, like that's usually a sign of how bad it's gotten. Oh crap. Scorpions. Like, where's our buddy? Where's... yeah. Oh, were we going the wrong way? I think we were. Oh, no. We really went the wrong way. Okay. Hello. Say goodbye, fire a rifle in the air to all of the fallen and so on. Oh, that's cool. Do we call? Okay, we'll we'll deal with that here soon. We gotta We gotta figure out what's up here. Good morning, night city. Radio, smooth music for a smooth ride. Is it a mirage? A hologram? No, my friends. It's clear open skies. But don't take it from me. Get out there and enjoy the sun. Out of the way, coming through. Oh no. In the bathroom. Oh fuck. Bird offs herself to express her undying gratitude to you for saving her ass. Stop talking. I was only gone an hour. How'd this happen? I don't know. I told you. Evie was lying in bed like always when I went out. And I got back to... <sighs> Fuck. 
If I had just known, I'd have... Don't blame yourself. Won't solve anything. I should have sensed something. That it was off. <laughs> Stop. Couldn't watch you 24-7. She made up her mind. Would have found a way. Always. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. They'll be here soon. <sighs> Told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? All things considered, you let them off pretty light. Had it been me, they'd have gotten an earful like nobody's biz. It's not a time for rational thoughts. Put something on her. Sometimes. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Could you wait outside? Let's talk to Johnny. Close the door, V. Please. Sig. Didn't know you smoked. <sighs> Quit. It's been years. This view. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. <sighs> Here. That was her smoke case. Want to hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. Kind of glad it's you that has it, actually. Don't set her hair on fire. It happened to me once. down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. Stay strong, Judy. Don't let this tear you down. You know what? Let's just not say anything for a minute, okay? Her condition couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Doll Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So, psychological trauma had to be that. Did some more digging, and her virtues found Woodman. He kept her. And had his way with her. The things he did. 
And once he got bored, he pawned her off. Wait, so you found other recordings? Had another look at the corrupted ones. You know, lots of static. Hard to pick up anything, really. At some point, I stumbled on something like an echo of the spat we'd had last time we saw each other. But I know she wasn't scrolling. Then why was it saved as a virtue? Got no explanation for it. Maybe she recalled it later, relived it almost. Implant could have been on when, you know, as a defense mechanism, escaping into the past so as not to live in the present. I'm not going to ask what Woodman did. We can have an idea. I zeroed Woodman. Didn't plan on it. Just had the chips landed. Glad I did, though. Me too. I can't even imagine. Still, it's not enough. There are so many more like him. Man, even the be something I can do about it. That leg shaking is so like real. What? So real. Don't know yet. Think I'll call Suze. Thanks, V. Sorry. But uh I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Sure you don't need anything. No, but sweet of you to ask. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. It's like, check this rooftop for loot. Don't you do anything, Judy. So judging by her tone, there was nothing we could have done to stop that. When she called, it was already done. Okay. Well. Unless we have any more sudden calls. Let's go ahead and finally go back to the bazaar. See what Takamura is up to. Man, that sucks because I was really hoping we were going to be able to talk to Evelyn again and try and get some more answers about all the stuff going on. <sighs> Actually, um, I need to go to the Ripper dock and get a, that new piece installed. So let me go ahead and do that first and then we'll uh, go talk to Takamura.